how India may have gone ASA radar could unlock Su-57 jets full potential surpassing current Russian capabilities. India's advancements in radar technology could significantly enhance the capabilities of Russia's Su-57 fifth generation stealth fighter jet. Should India decide to collaborate on the project? A senior Indian Air Force IF official recently disclosed details of a Russian proposal involving the transfer of technology for the Su-57 will focus on India's superior radar systems. The key to this potential upgrade lies in India's development of gallium nitride gone based active electronically scan array ASA radars. These systems offer a considerable performance advantage over the older gallium arsenide GAAS, technology currently used in many radar systems. According to the IAF official, India has made substantial progress in GN-based ASA radar technology, exceeding Russia's current capabilities. GAN offers improved efficiency, power, heat management, and detection range, making it essential for advanced radar systems. Specifically, India's Utam GAN ASA radar, currently under development by the Defense Research and Development Organization, DRDO, for the Advanced Medium Combat Aircraft, AMCA, program is being considered as a potential upgrade for the Su-57. While the Su-57's current N036 Bielka radar and X-band ASA radar is an improvement over older designs, it reportedly still relies on GAAS technology. Sources indicate that the N036 contains 1,514 transmit slash receive modules in contrast. The UTOM radar utilizes GAN technology and features over 1,400 transmit slash receive modules, granting enhanced range, resolution, and the ability to track multiple targets simultaneously. The integration of the India-made UTOM radar into the Su-57 is presented as a way to significantly boost the aircraft's combat capabilities. This aligns with India's broader strategy of incorporating domestically produced technology into its defense systems. The IF official stated that the UTOM gone ASA radar could be an excellent fit on the Su-57. Russia's proposal for Su-57 includes provisions for a technology transfer, potentially allowing India to integrate its own systems, like the UTOM radar. The IAF official explained that they have made better progress than Russia in some areas, including radar technology, and the Russian proposal for technology transfer could mean incorporating Indian systems on the Russian jet. Beyond the Su-57, Adopting the UTOM radar would offer the IF logistical and economic advantages. Because the UTOM is also planned for use in future variants of the Tejas, the MCA, and potentially upgraded Su 30 MKIs and Mirage 2000s integrated into the Su 57 with standardized radar systems across a significant portion of the IF's fleet. This commonality could simplify maintenance, training, and overall logistics. Although Russia has formally offered the Su, 57 to India. The IAF is still carefully considering its options. The official confirmed the offer but stated that the IAF is continuing its evaluation process. This evaluation likely involves a comprehensive review of the IAF's needs for a fifth generation fighter, weighing the Su 57 against other options, such as the American F 35, or potentially speeding up the AMCA program with international partners.